How's it going, everyone? How's it going? Uh, Sue Allen, I have a feeling it will be yes, man. Uh, <laughs> let's go. Let's go. Should we reveal the results? Uh, view results. Let's go. Oh, dang. We got a landslide, everyone. A landslide. Uh, this is nice and easy for me to add up as well, which is fortunate, right? Uh, I just want to give an honorable mention to uh, Caesar's Legion and New California Republic because they had no votes whatsoever. Which is good good going, guys. Good going. I see you know your stuff. I see you know your stuff. Uh, and then we've got, in second place... Oh, God. What's going on? My computer is really, really dodgy today. Touch wood, right? I don't want to jinx anything. I'll give her a pat on the head because she's, uh, she's a bit long in the tooth, is the old girl. Um, we've got one vote for Mr. House, and that came from YouTube, right? But then a resounding out, um, landslide. We got one vote for Yes Man on YouTube. One vote for Yes Man on Twitter. And then uh, all, of, all of you guys who voted today here, uh, which is four in total, voted for Yes Man. So Yes Man's got a total of six. So six to one between uh, Yes Man and Mr. House. So it's official. Independent Vegas. Let's go. Let's go. Inde it's going to be an independent Vegas. Uh, which is cool. Which is cool. I like this outcome, right? It's between uh, this outcome and Mr. House are probably my two favorites. Uh, the only reason why I'm not so fond of Mr. House is he likes to get rid of uh, the Brotherhood, which uh, is not nice. He's not nice. Uh, let's see. Mantis, we don't like the IRS and slavery here. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, yes, man also looks much friendlier. Yes, man's the best. I love Yes Man. He's so funny. He's so funny. That also means as well that we can um, we can ruin uh, the Legion and the uh, Great Khan allegiance uh, without any worries as well. So let's go and do that immediately, right? Uh, let's uh, we can fast travel to all these points, anyways. So let's start with um, let's start with uh, Jack and uh, the other girl who I, whose name I've forgotten already. Jack and Sarah, right? They should be easy because we've done a lot of work for these pair. Where are they? Are they asleep? It, it says they're around here somewhere. Jack? Sarah? Oh, they probably sleep in here, right? Oh, what's that? I can't. I'm stuck. Is that a magazine? It is. It's, it's actually stealing, so I want to be hidden while I do this. Right, we don't want a Mage's Guild uh, situation all over again. All right, maybe they sleep in here. Hello! Oh, Diane, I beg your pardon. Diane is her name. I was thinking of Sarah hey, in uh, Vault 21, right? Which we've got to go and speak to because I've got some jumpsuits on me. I don't think it'll work uh, because we weren't allowed to sell a Vault 34 jumpsuits, but you never know. You never know. Uh, Mantis, mm, just took some good screenshots. I'm addicted to taking screenshots. A Vegas? I bet it looks nice on your uh, setup as well, uh, Mantis. So, about the alliance with Caesar's Legion. Anders got back a little while before you <clears> did. He told me what happened. If that's how the Legion treats my people, I don't want any part of them. Uh, this is going to be an easy sell to these pair anyway. I forgot all about Anders. Uh, he was the guy up on the cross for months and months of in-game time. And somehow survived. So, about the alliance with Caesar's Legion... Don't worry, Jack and I have talked it over. We'll talk up the idea of breaking the alliance. Excellent. All right. Um, all right, that's fine. Uh, we don't have uh, the stats to be able to do uh, the chem making with these guys because they've actually got another quest tied to them. But uh, like I say, we're too stupid. Hey, what's up? What's up, buddy? Um... Mantis, yes. Uh, however, I did pick up Fallout 1 and 2 on Epic today. Nice. Nice. Uh, I still haven't played 1 and 2. Uh, but uh, I've got 1 installed on my PC already. Uh, so uh, I'm uh, willing to pl give them a try at some point. Uh, Lost Keeper, wipe out the Legion. Stab him in the backs. <laughs> Let's go. Uh, Mantis, they gave him away for free? Are you kidding me? I'm going to have to check that. I'm going to have to check that. Even though I've got them both on Game Pass. 
uh, still, right? I'm going to have to check that. I've got epic. Uh, make a salad out of Caesar. <laughs> Toss him. <laughs> Definitely not what I'm used to, lol. Right, let's go. Uh, I'm here to ask you publicly to oppose Papa Khan's alliance with Caesar. Oh, it's cool, kitten. Diane passed me the haps on that Fandango with Anders. I got your back. Coolio, so they're both on board. Uh, science, I know a few recipes. Yeah, that's what we can't do for these guys because they're too stupid. Uh, you've got an impressive setup here. Have you considered making more helpful chems? I think we've asked him that, even though it's not blacked out. Uh, and he was like, no. <laughs> I thought of make pack. What's the point? Right? So that's those two taken care of. Uh, next on the list, I think we'll go to Melissa next, right? Uh, and she is here. Is that... No, it's not. It must be a different girl to who I'm thinking, right? Uh, Mantis, yeah, Fallout 1, and 1, 2, and Tactics is free as a bundle, and sale ends on the 5th of September. I better, uh, hurry up then. Oh, it is her, right? She's the one from Quarry Junction. How's it going? Uh, Regis, Regis says I should talk to you about speaking against the Great Khan's alliance with Caesar. You can ask, but why would I do that? Carl told me all about the life in the Legion. Carl's dead, by the way. Uh, did he also tell you that women aren't, women aren't permitted to serve in the Legion? What? No, he... What do you mean, aren't allowed to serve? This is the girl with Why the accidental, um, New Zealand accent. Because they didn't, uh, they didn't tell, uh, the voice actor. Uh, it was a genuine mistake. Uh, if the Great Khans join the Legion, you'll be sold as a slave, an officer's wife, if you're lucky. That lying little weasel. I almost fell for it too. All right, you've got a deal. You can tell Papa I won't support an alliance. All right, time for me to go. Later. I like Melissa. She's cool. Um, what was what was his name? The guy who works in Sloan. Turns out that uh, that was her dad, right? Right. We're gonna go to the fort next because we're gonna do everything that we can in order to get the Khans uh, and the Legion to break up. So I'm gonna just go over here and pick up some evidence as well. Gotta hit the road, but have fun. Thanks for uh, thanks for hanging out today, Kip. Good luck with um, the MRI results as well, okay? And happy Big Friday as well if I don't see you. Have a good weekend if I don't see you beforehand. Uh, keep holdout weapons. Let's go. Wait, I didn't get this option before. What holdout weapons have I got on me this time that I didn't have last time? Oh, pew pew. Pew pew is a holdout weapon. Okay, let's go. Right. Uh, we just gotta be here, like, ever so, uh, swiftly, right? And there's no, no point in sticking around. The Legion don't hate us yet, though. Yet. Right, they might do after, uh, what we're about to do, though. We're on thin ice with the Legion to begin with, anyway. But I did do a couple of things which gave us a little bit of fame after the, uh, faction reset. So, you never know. Doesn't matter anyway, because eventually we're going to be uh, siding with Yas Man, of course. And as soon as we do that, somehow Le Caesar will know and he won't be happy. Kill Caesar! I don't think we can manage it right now. Uh, not with our equipment and not with uh, who he's got uh, around him in his tent. That's the wrong way. Our way! Yes! Our way. Yeah, I don't think we'd be able to, even if we tried. Uh, interesting thing about this game, though, which is pretty cool, is that you can uh, kill pretty much all of the faction leaders you without... Oh, yeah, my dog. I forgot. Uh, you can enter all of the... Uh, sorry, you can kill pretty much any of the uh, faction leaders and still work for them, which is kind of interesting. Uh, wait here, boy. Good boy. Right, you stay by there. Right, now the evidence is here. So I just want to... Is this it? Legion Slave Ledger. I think that's it, right? It's not even stealing! Alright, give me that. Right, and that's uh, that's the evidence that is going to be sufficient for the Great Khans. I'm not going to leave my dog behind this time either, I'll remember. As much as I'd like to, uh, Mantis. Uh, like I said, I don't think we'll stand a chance. 
if we uh, just randomly attack Caesar. Right, we've got everything that we need now, so back to Red Rock Canyon. This isn't necessary, by the way, but um, I do... I do think that the Great Khans uh, don't deserve any more tragedy, right? They've gone through enough uh, throughout history, so we're gonna uh, we're gonna keep them independent and keep them alive. More of my advisors <clears throat> are starting to talk openly of breaking our alliance. I wonder where that idea is coming from. Me? <laughs> um. Oh, dang! I need. It's not you. I need to speak to. It's Regis. You're becoming quite the political agitator. I can't say I'm displeased. Uh, have a look at this book. It will show you what happens to tribes that ally with Caesar's legion. Let me see. My God, this is even worse than I thought. Okay, you have my support. I'll tell Papa the alliance is a bad idea. Okay, and now we talk to Papa Khan. Hey, buddy. All four of my most trusted advisors have told me we should break our alliance. Maybe I should hear you out after all. Yeah, if you know what's good for you. Uh, I've come to ask the Great Khans to break their alliance with Caesar's Legion. Hmm. I've heard some things from my most trusted Khans. It makes me wonder whether this alliance is a good idea after all. But I want to leave a legacy of greatness when I die. My tribe deserves better than this, cowering in a canyon and living on scraps. Tell me then. If I don't join with Caesar's Legion, where will I find my tribe's lost glory? All right, hear me out. Hear me out, Papa Khan. Uh, let's see. You don't look, need to look outward, Mighty Khan. Your tribe is proud and strong. Claim your own glory. What great legacy do the great Khans have? Your tribe is nothing but ghosts and martyrs. That's not very nice. Let's stick with the uh, top one, right? Claim your own glory. Well spoken, traveler. Well spoken indeed. Perhaps it's time to find our own destiny, unburdened by the past. We'll begin readying the camp to move. As soon as Caesar makes his move, we'll depart. We will make ourselves strong again, and we shall conquer. Um. <laughs> as long as you are fighting for Caesar, I don't care what you do. Uh, that sounds wise. I wish you the best. If you should ever tire wandering alone, seek us out. You might just have the makings of a great con yourself. You, you want? I'm idolized! Idolized by the Khans! Let's go! Can I join? Oh, you're back. Oh, he, he was lying. I can't join the Khans. Alright. Alright, now that we know what we uh, want to do with the Mojave, okay? Now that we've uh, sealed its fate, so so to speak, let's look at our quest, uh, our quest uh, log, right? Uh, if you keep continuing to work against this interest, you will be marked as an enemy. I'm surprised that that's still there, right? Because we just broke up an alliance between them and the Great Khans. So, I'm surprised that that hasn't, uh, kicked that off. Uh, don't tread on the bear for the Republic. Render and Caesar. We want wild card, right? So, wild card is, uh, what we're going to be doing. Uh, kill or disable Mr. House, you say? Alright, let's go. Uh, world map. Right, we want to be going. Uh, we want to be going to the strip, and I've got just the thing for, uh, for Mr. House. You ready? Just the thing, indeed. Oh, I've got dehydration. Shit. Um, I. Oh, God damn it! I'm gonna have to use my purified water. Right. Eat this maze. That'll help. Um, Nuka Cola is plus H2O, isn't it? Yeah, for some odd reason. Uh, H2O minus 153. How are we looking? Alright, that's good enough. And we only used one purified... I'm down to four? That's ridiculous. Yeah, we're gonna kill, uh... Kill old Mr. Housey! Let's go! Let's go, I've got just a way for him to go as well. Just the way. I'm gonna have to do this alone though, because if you remember, my companions aren't allowed up there. Oh. Oh. Oh, fuck. Stupid game. Hold on, bear with. Beg your pardon. <laughs> At least it wasn't like an awful sound that time, right? Let me close the game. Ah. Right. Fingers crossed. 
right? Because we were going through a load zone then as as it crashed. Fallout doesn't really want to play nice tonight, huh? Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to figure out how to run this game on PC. Hey, my neighbors will be spared. <laughs> Downloading saved games. That's not a good sign either. We were going by our... This is why I need to save more often. It's uh, too risky going by auto saves, right? Oh, come on. It's taking its time. Almost there, then. Be cool. Be cool. Come on. It's almost there. I don't know why it needs to re-download my saves. And that's alarming me because, like I said, we were just going through a load zone. And that's when it auto-saves. Loading down loadable content. Let's go. Continue from last save game. Ah, let's go. It's fine. We made it through into the lucky 38. Right, okay, let's go. Oh, get that mouse out of here as well. Right, we want to go to... Presidential. Is this the presidential suite? No. Uh, we want to go to the penthouse. All right. All right, let's get ready for this. Weapons. Uh, I made sure to carry this with me through pretty much most of the game for just this uh, specific reason. Now, the thing that concerns me is can I break in here? Oh, it's not even a, a lockpick check. Uh, open arch chamber. Yes. Now, everything's going to go absolutely flipping mental and kick off at me now. So... Oh, oh, I'm in trouble. I'm in trouble. Right. It's a good thing we didn't upgrade these things yet, right? In here. Requires key. Okay. Activate terminal. Uh, unlock control room elevator. Yes. Quickly. I'm getting shot. I'm very, very much getting shot. Control room. Mr. House. How are we doing, buddy? We're about to see his actual true form. Unseal uh, LS chamber, yes. <laughs> Some of you are going to get the reference for this, but uh, we're about to get an in-game achievement for this as well. Hello, Mr. House. How are we doing? Um, I do feel, I do feel kind of, uh, sorry for him. Because, let's be honest, right? Aside from wanting to kill, uh, off the Brotherhood, and for good reason as well, right? He's basically more technology than man at this point. And we all know what the Brotherhood are like with technology. So, you can kind of understand why. But I would say that Mr. House is actually really good for New Vegas. He's the reason why it's in good, such good shape anyways, right? It's just unfortunate. He couldn't get um, uh, all of his... He had laser counter, uh, counter systems that destroyed... Oh, I forget the numbers, right? There was like 20-odd nukes uh, coming for New Vegas. And only like a handful of them got through. And I think he genuinely has New Vegas' interests at heart. And he was, uh, there's some dialogue, I don't know if we went through it or not, but he was like, give me a certain amount of time and I can col send colonies out into space. I think he's a really good, uh, a, a really good option for the future of mankind in this uh, universe. Uh, but, you know, you guys have spoken and uh, yes, independent Vegas is a good uh, option as well. But I genuinely like house and i do think that he has uh vegas's best interests at heart and i do think he is a good option uh to side with 
But, uh, Yes Man needs you out of the way. Your vanity project doomed to fail. Why does his dick have a vent ventilator? Oh, Ash, you're going to like this reference coming up in a moment. Uh, Mantis, this might sound bad, but I always regret killing Mr. House. Mm, that's my point. Yeah, I'm going to regret this too. I'm going to feel really bad about this. Because, like I said, I like Mr. House. I don't think he's a bad guy. I really don't. Uh, I think he's very genuinely unselfish as well. I think he just has humanity's uh, best interests at heart. This is like this is really heartbro heartbreaking. Um, let me get rid of that a second. There's something seriously wrong with my rig tonight. It's very very wobbly. Uh, touch wood. But uh, it is what it is, right? Time for you to die, Mr. House. Nice beard as well. Yeah. <laughs> See the in-game achievement up there? A, t a slave obeys? That's a Bioshock reference right there. Uh, if you didn't know about it, if you kill Mr. House with a golf club, you get an in-game achievement for extra experience. There's a bunch of them. There's a bunch of secret ones as well. And uh, that was uh, a Bioshock reference right there. Uh, it seems to have taken that well. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what, this golf club? Um, should we put him away? He's kind of gross, right? Oh, I can't? I can't close his little chamber. Right. Remind me never to enter this room ever again. Uh, <laughs> his grand dreams for New Vegas will never be realized. Oh, that hurts. Oh, God. They're still angry. Oh, no. Are we cool? Are we cool? Alright, cool. Uh, what happens to uh, Jane as well? I forget. Does she stay alive? Let's go and have a look. Oh, if she's gone, we can't turn in any more... Um any more uh, snow globes. Where's my doggo? Hey. Any of you seen my... Is he upstairs? He might be upstairs. Shouldn't enter his room ever again. Let's go, buddy. Follow me. Why was... Why did he stay here? I know we came here by accident, right? Is he with me now? Yeah, yeah let's go, doggo. Right, let's go and speak to Yes Man. I gotta speak to Sarah as well while I'm out on the strip. Cause uh, I've gotta get rid of these uh these jumpsuits, right? They're gonna be weighing me down. Yeah, but I, it's pretty cool. A little Bioshock reference. Right, there he is. Old smiley. Let's go. Why am I jumping? That's my oblivion habit, that is. Hello. <laughs> Can I help you with something else? Um, I'm ready for you to join me at the Lucky 38. Maybe we should have gone and seen Sarah first. That's okay. We can do it after this. Mr. House is out of the picture and you have the platinum chip? Wonderful. Let's go. Yeah, I don't feel good about it though, yes, man. I felt really horrible, actually. I felt bad for him. Always be jumping. Hopping and skipping. Springing my step. All right, off we go. I wonder if Victor dies if you do it this way as well, right? Or at least he, he like, becomes just a regular Securitron or something. I think what happens from this point on, if Jane isn't around, I think every time that you pick up a, um, uh, a snow globe, then, uh, is it the, it's the penthouse, right? I always forget. Uh, I think it just deposits the money into your account, like, or into your inventory, rather, straight away. Indeed. Trip Mantis. Thank you for the follow. Thank you very much, buddy. The Tree Mantis followed your channel. Let's go. Thank you for the follow. Uh, 
<laughs> what is that if you meant? Pizza time! Let's go! I had pizza the other day. It was just a frozen pizza, though. It was alright. Did the job. Right, we've we've already seen this, but we've seen it with um, Mr. House. But now, uh, we didn't save, right? Because we didn't save because it kind of messed up uh, a few quests. So we didn't save it. But now we're going to see it with the uh, Yes Man giving a demonstration. Oh, hail the Yes Man. Let's go. It is the greatest Spider-Man. <laughs> This is what we did over in the fort when we went downstairs. We upgraded the uh, Securitron. <laughs> I got to I got to admit this is more fun with uh, Yes Man doing the demonstration. He has the best meme. Mantis, I know you just followed. But I'm uh I'm gonna say something that you might not like. Toby Maguire is my least favorite Spider-Man. He's my least favorite. I did like Willem Dafoe as Green Goblin though. He was sick. So here's the idea, right, of what, well, what we've just done. We're now in charge of New Vegas, and we've got up an army of upgraded Securitrons to enforce, um, well, not our rule. That sounds a bit like tyranty. Uh, the idea is that New Vegas is going to be independent, uh, and we have control. Uh, <laughs> please don't unfollow. <laughs> please don't unfollow. <laughs> okay. It's just my humble opinion. It's just my humble opinion. Right. Uh, Caesar's Legion, we're still mixed. We're still mixed with Caesar's Legion somehow. Uh, they don't vilify us. Oh, and we leveled. Let's go. Right. Let's put everything in energy weapons. Right. Because that's what we're concentrating on at the moment. Uh, no perk for that level, though. That was a boring level. Okay, quest failed. Render unto Caesar. We're going to fail a bunch of stuff now because uh, we just actually uh, committed to Yes Man. Caesar's higher. Don't know what that quest even is. Caesar's favor. We don't, we're definitely unable to obtain the Lucky Shades now as well. Don't tread on the bear. Failed. Oh, we better talk to Yes Man before we leave. For the Republic, part two failed. Complete. The NCR is a robust network of informants, blah, blah, blah. Uh, knows that you are working against this interest and will no longer accept your help. So we are enemies of the NCR and we're, we should be enemies of Caesar's Legion now as well. Yes, man. you That's a good look on you, buddy. Up there on the big TV. I love yes, man. Oh, this mission. This quest. He finally escaped the 3 by 4 Okay, so, 
Uh, bearing in mind that we just became enemies of the NCR, right? Um, we can either go and try and prevent this uh, assassination. Let's find out why Mr. House wanted him kept alive. Mr. House ran projections on how the NCR public will react to a defeat at Hoover Dam. Overwhelmingly, they'll blame Kimball. But if Kimball dies at Hoover Dam, there's no obvious scapegoat for them to blame. So they'll blame New Vegas instead. So that means reduced tourism for up to five years. <laughs> Equations are pretty... It all comes down to tourism. Mr. House sure likes numbers. Uh, I'm on good terms with the NCR. What? <laughs> Didn't they just... Didn't they just say that they know I've been working against their interests and they'll no longer work? Okay, I'm on good terms with the NCR, whatever. Great. A ranger named Graham has been placed in charge of security for the president's visit. You'll want to talk to him. Once the president is safe, there's one more thing for you to take care of. This gadget I'm handing you is called an override module. Mr. House had two of these made years and years ago. Just like him to think ahead. Take the module to the El Dorado substation and attach it to the power control terminal. I'll handle the rest. Okay. I'll get it done. Great. There is an option where you this can just say, oh, yeah, don't bother with Kimball. Let him die. <laughs> and you can, skip that, uh, you can skip the quest altogether. That's what I was going to get around to, but... Uh, I picked the option to go and do it. So, uh, what are we going to... Let's have a look at our quest log real quick. Uh, wild card, finishing touches. Go to the Eldorado power station, blah, blah, blah. Uh, report to Ranger Grant. That's what we want to be doing, right? We, you'll know it when it happens. We'll do that one first. Uh, and I think... Oh! Another thing that we need to do. Uh, we need to go back to Freeside as well. And we need to pick up Arcade. Because Arcade's going to be very happy with the outcome of uh, our decisions. Uh, let's go Casino. Rex should still be here as well, because we didn't make a mistake. Let's go, boy. We're going to go and pick up... Uh, we're going to go and pick up Arcade as well, as soon as we can. So follow me. Right, and uh, before I forget as well, let's go and see Sarah in Vault 21. Just so... Uh, just so I can try and get rid of some uh, carry weight, if nothing else. Hopefully, though, she'll want to buy them uh, the proper way through the, uh, the speech option. Hello. Look at these guys all upgraded. They no lo longer look like police. They look like army men now. I feel like I've been back and forth uh, Vault 21 more times in this playthrough than I ever have <laughs> in, in any playthrough. Well, well, if it isn't the Vault Explorer herself, welcome back. Uh, I have Vault gear for you. You do? That's wonderful. Let me see what you brought. All right. That's going to net you lots of caps, my friend. Do you want to trade all your Vault suits right now? Uh, I read on the uh, wiki because I was looking into Sarah. <laughs> Uh, and why uh, we couldn't sleep with her. Uh, so I was looking on the wiki. It says on the wiki to give her vault suits one at a time, but we haven't been doing that. So, yeah, I would like that. Oh, that makes 150 so caps. Let's go. More PJs already worn and still warm. Let's go. Hey, stranger. Where you been, huh? I missed you. That's, that's, new, uh, that's new dialogue. That's new dialogue. Yeah, pass by my room and we'll catch up. Let's go. You're kicking me into gear, huh? Well, I think I'll drive my chassis over to your pad. Wait for me down there and don't forget the oil. Oh, dang, it worked. It worked. I thought we'd mess this up. Right, where do I go? Sarah, where do you live? <laughs> where do I live? Hold on, where's my room? Does anyone remember? Where do we need to go? <laughs> I don't want to mess this up. Right. Uh, she lived, I think... Where's the main gambling room? Oh, rather, the last time I stayed here, it was like down here, right? Oh, dang. We didn't mess up with Sarah. Huh? 
Oh! Oh! Oh, it is the normal way, right? You're quite an easy lady, Mecca! <laughs> I know. Why is the dog barking? Oh, we're not done! Oh my gosh. I think she liked it. I think she enjoyed it, right? I'm now well rested. I look forward to the next ride. Once I recover, you monster. Dang, she enjoyed herself. Okay, that's just another uh, notch on our bedpost, I guess. Right, is this Sarah's? Uh... Right, is something that I want to check. I think this is Sarah's room. Yes. Okay, I knew it. There's a snow globe in here. Who do we hand that over to now? Now that Jane's gone. Jane was the uh, Securitron that we gave. Uh, <laughs> the dog likes to watch. At least uh, we didn't force Arcade to watch this time, right? We could have, because I'm like on my way to pick him up. But uh, I was just too excited about the premise of sleeping with Sarah. Because I thought we messed it up. <laughs> you took her down just to rob her. <laughs> I just wanted the snow globe. That's not actually stealing. It's just in an area that's trespassing, unfortunately. The snow globe's not actually classed as, uh, as stealing. I don't think I can hand it in for caps, though. I'm not sure. I think Jane's dead. Jane was Mr. House's uh, robot girlfriend. Right, we can fast travel from here. No need to go through any uh, load zones. I'm so happy, though. I thought we missed that. And I think that's... Apart from uh, Sweetie in West Side, uh, I think that's every character that you can sleep with, we've slept with. But uh, in the interest of keeping uh, keeping that going, right? Where's West Side? It's over here somewhere. <laughs> Just because it's tradition, right? Uh, where was the uh, brothel? Where? Uh, what's the name? Pretty. Pretty Jane or Sue or whatever her name was. Pretty... Pretty something, right? The burnt girl. Um, we've been there before. I can't remember how to get there again. She's the one that got burnt by Cook Cook. Is it over here? No, that's a store there, right? While we're here, though, I may as well uh, drop some weight and make some money. Hey, buddy. Howdy. Name's Bob, but I don't recognize this guy. This guy. What can I do you for? Uh, I take it you're from Klamath. Yeah, good old Klamath. Not a bad place if you like hunting, eating, and skinning geckos all day. <laughs> it's a pretty dull place. We've been to the shop before. Excitement when this tribal from Arroyo came to town years back. All before my time, though. That's the protagonist of Fallout 2 that he just mentioned there. Uh, show me where you have a sale. All right then. Hopefully, I've got something to wet your whistle. Right. Okay. Yeah, we definitely haven't been here before. Right. Miscellaneous, because I've got a bunch of cigarettes to sell. Right. It's only going to weigh me down. Uh, keep the Deathclaw eggs. Uh, there we go. And I'll sell this bit of pre-war money that we have as well. Um, what else can we get rid of while we're here? I've got a bunch of explosives on me that I forgot about. That'll do. Right. I have some questions about this area. I might have some answers for you. What did you want to know? Um. <laughs> oh yeah, let's ask him about the super mutant, right? Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's mean son of a bitch. I know the name sounds bad, but he likes it. He's one nasty old coot. Far as I can tell, he's one of them original super mutants. What came from the boneyard? 
Wondered about after that master fellow died. Another reference to Fallout One. The hub back in NCR. Boy, they sure treated him mean down there. Cut him up so bad he can't talk no more. I tried to buy him just so they'd stop hurting him, but they didn't want any of it. Um. People aren't afraid of him. Some folks steer clear of him for sure, but he don't seem to mind. Okay. Well, things aren't great here, but I've seen a lot worse. We've got the fiends to the south of us, and that ain't good. The scorpions hang out at the Monte Carlo when they aren't slinging chems or getting their heads blown off by Monte the Carlo. Fiends. Probably the best thing we've got going on is the co-op, run by Mr. Etienne. Get some help from the followers of the apocalypse, I think. Okay, Monte Carlo. Uh, tell me about the scorpions. Not much to tell. Typical gang of dumb bullies and angry nobodies. They're holed up a bit south of here, in the Monte Carlo suites. They think they're tough, but any time they tangle with the fiends, they get torn right up. Alright, anyway, enough. Oh. What do Oh, no. I thought I said what, uh, what is there to do around here. Hey, I have no more questions. Let's talk about something else. Goodbye. Alright. Where was the brothel? I can't remember. I'm sure it's here, right? Let's consult the map. Girls Pawn Shop, West Side West Entrance, the Thorn, South Entrance. Yeah, because this is where we came to investigate uh, the Ranger disappearing. And then we uh, saw that guy from the followers, and he was like, oh, yeah, don't, don't say anything, and something, something. Right, this doesn't go in there, does it? North Cistern. I mean, we could check that uh, local map. North Cistern, Mojave Wasteland, Westside Co-op. Uh, maybe there? Gal's Pawn Shop, North Sewers, Liquor Store. Yeah, it must be the Casa Madre, right? Uh, Casa Madrid, even. Which is straight up. Straight up ahead. Isn't that where Mean, mean Son of a Bitch is guarding? Oh, here we go. Casa Mad uh, Madrid. I think this is where we're looking for. Be cool. Yeah, this mean son of a bitch. Hey, buddy. Ah, here we go. And this is pretty Sarah. It was Sarah. I thought so. What do you need this time? Uh, all right. Where's Sweetie? Let's go and talk to Sweetie. I can't remember where she was, though. We were here a while back. Kind of robbed the place, but no one no one knows about that, so keep that under your hat. Don't tell anyone. Maybe I could just ask Pretty Sarah. Oh, she might be upstairs, actually. What do you need this time? Uh, merchandise. What, you lost me? No, okay. We can't ask her about it. All this, right, just for another, uh, just a, comp just for another notch on my bedpost. You, oh, you're the old lady. Right, and you're the guy. Sweetie! Hi again, you here to play? You betcha, how much does it cost? It's worth every cat, baby. I'll do things to you you didn't even think was possible. Oh? I'll leave you feeling like everything's right in the world. Oh? 300 caps? 300 caps? That's expensive. She better be... She better be... She better not be lying about what she just said, right? I am rich, though, so it doesn't really matter. Get Have you tried to sleep with everyone? Yeah, this is the last one. This is the only person we haven't. Everyone else who you can, we have. Including Benny. <laughs> wait, that was it? Oh, no, wait. Huh? Hi again. You here to play? That was it? You know... That was it? Oh, I just got ripped off, I think. Yeah, I got totally ripped off. Right, let's get out of here. 
before I pull out my gun. Where have I got equipped right now? My golf club. Before I pull out my golf club and start swinging. Unbelievable. What, what an absolute letdown, right? Robbed. I know. I know. She was bigging that up as well, as if it was going to be something special. Right, where are we heading to? Uh, I might need a disguise for this. Uh, I'm not sure, right? Because... Wait. What quest are we on? Report to Ranger Grant. Oh, I forgot. Uh, at least I was... Well, I was considerate, right? I was considerate. I didn't pick up Arcade. So let's go back to free uh, Freeside. And go and get him. But uh, we've ticked off every... I think... It, I'm pretty sure it's everyone. Right? I'm pretty sure it's everyone. Everyone uh, slept with me. Rod face, why won't you bloody put the hat on? I can't even give him any money, right? He's taken all the money that he can. There's, he's supposed to get a hat. And it's um, it's a hat of a character that's not even in the... How about you? How dare you attack my precious kings? Screw you, buddy. Get out of here. Yeah, he's supposed to get a hat from Eulogy Jones. And Eulogy Jones isn't even in this game. He's a Fallout 3 character. But I've given him all the money I can give him. And he's not getting his hat. Right. These kids are going to be eating well again tonight. No gunpowder in this uh, in this rat this time. Hey, you're the one who's been going around helping people around That's here, me. Right? King says to keep up the good work. I said to give you this. Pinion nuts. Thank you. Why did I go into third person all of a sudden? Right, we want to go in Mormon Fort because that's where uh, Arcade's going to be hanging out. Where's the entrance? Here we are. See, I even left the head intact for the for the kids to eat that time. Didn't blow it up with my gun. Right, where's Arcade? Buddy. Oh, he's still got his combat armor on. I forgot about that. I'm going to need that off you, uh, though, Arcade. Um, I think we should travel together. A courier, doctor, and a cybernetic dog. After we deal with the whole imminent conquest of New Vegas problem, we should open an act at the tops. Yeah, let's do that. Right, what's your opinion on the current situation? I think you're on the right track. The only way to ensure relative safety in <laughs> oh, she's back to life. New Vegas is to prevent others from taking control of the region. That means no NCR, no Mr. House, and no Legion. Um, let's trade equipment, because I want that sure. combat armor off you like to repair my own. Okay. Right, he's got some other stuff as well. Right, hopefully now, hopefully we'll get the next part of his... Uh, of his quest. I can't even I can't even repair my own co combat armor. Sure. I think it's because it's in okay, full like full condition. Okay. There you go, you can have it back. To to oh here we go. Yeah, Excellent. Yeah. Straight away. Straight into it. Sure. Any day now? Caesar's going to try to march across Hoover Dam and kick NCR out of the Mojave. We're getting caught up in something important out here. Hell, after how you handled Benny, you're practically right in the middle of all this. I know I'm just along for the ride, but it's made me think about the past. How I might be able to help out. What are you talking about? I wasn't always with the followers. Or with the NCR. My late father was an officer in a group called the Enclave. Dum, dum, dum. This pre-war government. Memories being short around here, not a whole lot of people remember them. But they did bad things. Terrorized communities, kidnap people. Eventually someone stopped them. I was born a few years later at a military base on the coast. A place called Navarro. Where did the Enclave go? If you, um, if you, this is the, like the second Fallout that you played, like me, because I played this, uh, I played uh, number three, rather, beg your pardon. I played number three, then I played this, right? And uh, the Enclave um, are the main antagonists in number three. So uh, that's kind of like a big twist when uh, RK tells you that uh, he's basically got connections with the Enclave. A lot of different places. I only know what I was told. Some of them were cut down by the NCR and the Brotherhood. Some of them went east. 
My mother never told me what happened to my father, but she and I went south with some others and integrated into the NCR. When the NCR learned that Enclave personnel had integrated, we kept moving to the fringes. <laughs> he looks very. He looks like a very good disguised Clark Kent. Just the wrong hair color, right? If he had black hair, then it, it would be spot on. What happened to Navarro? After the Enclave's command structure fell apart, it was only a matter of time before Navarro was overrun by NCR forces. My mother and I left with some of the troopers from my father's old unit, the same people I've kept in contact with over the years. Anyone who didn't get out was killed by the NCR. Even some of the ones who escaped were eventually hunted down by the Brotherhood of Steel. That's why he's good disguise, because he's blonde. I gotcha. I gotcha. Uh, where are you going with all this? The Enclave did a lot of bad things, but there were good people at Navarro. Good people with a lot of experience. Not many of them are alive anymore, but I think they can make a difference in the fight against Caesar. Uh, do you want them to help the NCR? Uh, say no more, I'll do it. Great. I'd like you to talk to the old timers, the remnants. I don't think I can convince them by myself. To them, I'm still a kid. But you're a big part of what's happening out here. When you talk to them, they'll understand how important this all is. I've kept in contact with them over the years, so I know where you can find them. But I doubt they'll open up to you unless I come along. I know I'm not always the most serious guy around, but this means a lot to me. Thanks. And there we go. Now we've got for old Lang Syne. And uh, this is why I kept Arcade around, right? Now, unfortunately, you have to have had um, basically an event happen where you're going towards the end of the game. So in other words, by killing Mr. House and siding with, um, with uh, Yes Man, this is why the uh, next part of his uh, companion quest is kicked in. We already went around collecting all the arcade points that we could. Uh, when he, he comments on things like technology and things that he shouldn't know about, that's obviously because he knows about them from being part of the Enclave. Uh, and now that uh, that event has happened, we can go and get a super good reward uh, for, for doing his, uh, his uh, quest line now. And that's why I didn't sell him to Caesar either. Uh, basically, when I say um, uh, an event that steers you towards the end of the game as well, not if you side with Caesar though, because Arcade flipping hates Caesar. He can't stand Caesar. Uh, he, um, he wants, ultimately, he wants, uh, or his best uh, possible outcome for New Vegas is an independent Vegas, which is what we're aiming for right now because we sided with, uh, with Yes Man. So now we can go and do Old Lang Sign. And uh, gets a really, really cool reward as a result as well. But I'm going to drop a pause there, okay? Uh, because I need to go and take another quick break. Not as long as last time, right? And no poll this time because we've already decided. We'll call it no longer than four minutes, right? No longer than four minutes. And when I come back then, we'll get on with the uh, Arcade's quest line. And uh, get, it's, it's, it's a really sick reward that we're going to get. So uh, bear with and I will be obby. That's such a banger of a tune, right? It's from the Streets of Rage 2 OST. One of my favorite games of all time, by the way. Back on a Sega Mega Drive. And uh, I need to add that playlist down below me. Because I I'm beginning to use it quite a lot. Because it's, it's the greatest video game OST ever. That shit, that shit was from a Sega Mega Drive. From 16-bit. Those guys used to do wizardry with their, their music on that system. It was insane. Anyway, enough about that. Hey. Let's go and uh, speak to all these old timers, right? And get the gang back together. Right, uh, so this should be easy enough because we've met most of them, right? One is over here in West Side, so let's go there. Come to think of it, right? If we were smart about this, we could have done this and slept with a prostitute all in one, in one fast travel. I don't want to leave again, right? We've already spoken to this guy. He is sitting down. Uh, I don't know if you remember, I was talking to him and Arcade was with me and I was like, he's got no reaction to Arcade being right here. Did I, did I fast travel to the entrance? I did. My bad. That's not the exit. That's the entrance. Right, let's go in. That's, by the way, no tea. Uh, you don't have tea? What do you have instead, Sue Allen? Let me guess. Gin? Do you have gin? Sticking around for the attractions. Uh, Arcade asked me to find you. I'm gathering the remnants. Hello, Arcade. Making some new 
friends are you? Oh, now you react. Now that I br actually bring it up, right? Beer! Let's go. I'm, uh, I'm keeping myself pure until tomorrow. I'm gonna have a little drink tomorrow, I think. Um, it was Arcade suggestion, not mine. It really must be bad out there if she's sending you to us. Is the idea that we swoop in by vertebrate guns blazing? Uh, sounds good to me. Does that mean you're in? I'll be there, but it won't mean squat if the rest of the group is there too. Oh, and you'll need my part of the passphrase to get into the bunker. Navarro. Yeah, <laughs> pure. <laughs> As in, I'm not drinking any alcohol until tomorrow. Uh... <laughs> Even though I've, as you know, I've broken my rule a couple of times this week, but uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have a little drink tomorrow. You enjoy that beer, though, Sue Ellen. You enjoy that beer. Um, uh, I would. Do you, do you guys want to hear a bit of lore about the old squad and the Enclave? Let's, let's hear a little bit about the Enclave at least, right? I miss those days sometimes. We all had a purpose. George were pretty ruthless. The rest of us, though, we were just trying to civilize things. The NCR was still new, and it didn't look like they'd last all that long. Then we lost the oil rig, and shortly after that, the base at Novaro. Nobody left except us remnants. The oil rig? Him mentioning there that they lost the oil rig, that's a reference to Fallout 2. I think that's like the final thing that you do. In Fallout 2, you go and attack this big giant oil rig where the Enclave's main base is. Um, they kind of like the villains throughout uh, throughout Fallout. Like I said, they're the main antagonists in Fallout 3. But um, they what what they were? They're just the remnants of what used to be the U.S. government. They're like they're like um, you know the black armor that we got uh, from the update in Fallout 4, the fire the fire Hellfire armor. Uh, they wear black power armor. They've got all their own different variants. The exo armor is theirs as well. Uh, so they're kind of like they're kind of like an evil brotherhood in a way. What happened to the Enclave oil rig in Navarro? Here we go. We'll hear some uh, more references to Fallout 2 here, no doubt. Internal sabotage took down the oil rig. Never did get the full story. The NCR took out Navarro, saying we posed a threat to the region. Uh, I'd like to know, to know more about your former squad. I was the officer in charge, and Johnson and Moreno were my heavy hitters. Henry handled tech things, and Whitman flew the chopper. Johnson and Moreno never got along, and I had my hands full keeping those two apart some days. It was a difference in philosophy, mostly. Mercy was not part of Moreno's vocabulary. All right, cool. All right, let's get out of here and get to the next uh -huh. uh, old-timer. Right. Oh, Judah Krieger is the glue I forget. He has something to say every time. Years, and with good reason. Anyone who can command Moreno and Johnson in the same unit without somebody getting fragged is one hell of a leader. Krieger was polite and kind, but never warm. He always did his best to make me feel welcome in the group. I think he did it out of a sense of loyalty to my father. Loyalty means a lot to Judah. Not loyalty to the Enclave or even the ideals they fought for but to the people who served with him. They're loyal to you, too? Sometimes I wonder how much of my father they see in me. They went through a lot together, but my family went through it, too. I'm glad they've watched out for me all these years. Maybe someday I can return the favor. Oh, that's nice. Yeah, so um, you probably got the gist of this, but Arcade wasn't part of the squad. His father was. Um... So, yeah, that's his connections to the, uh, the Enclave. Ooh, uh, let's go over to... Let's go over to the gun runners, right? Because we can stock up on ammo while we're there as well. And then hopefully we can walk to these next two from here. Hey, buddy. Welcome, sir or madam. Do you wish to purchase something? It's ma'am. Um, yes. Right, I want to get... I'm going to, like, give over this uh, NCR money that I've been holding on to as well. Because I may as well, right? Get some money back while we're about to spend a load uh, here. Um, let's see. We want 308s. Because uh, that's going to feed our Gobi. Uh, where's all your 308, mate? 
Don't tell me you've got no 308. You're the flipping gun runners. Come on. Where's all this 308? Did I go past it? Oh my god, he's got no 308. You're fucking kidding me. Alright, that's great. Brilliant. Alright, forget it. I'll just take your money. Right, we'll come back here in a day or two. And he should have actually restocked all of his. I'm still holding this bloody... <laughs> oh, and all my hold, all my weapons uh, uh been uh, reset because... Where did we go? We went to um the fort, right? And uh, I could only hold my holdout weapons. What else have we got? That gun. There we go. I'm not too uh, convinced about our weaponry as well for the final battle. I'm a little bit uh, concerned that we don't have some like really heavy hitting guns. Uh, a riot shotgun would be nice, but we need the perks for that. Um, well, we'll figure that out when the time comes, right? We're getting a little head ahead of ourselves. Right, where is this guy? Is he actually in sharecroppers? Because we could have just teleported there. No magazine today, unfortunately. Right, I'm right on him, apparently. Maybe he's in this house. Let's go in here. Oh, hello. Ugh, looks like I forgot to lock the doors Wasn't that a dude uh, in our, Walking yeah, Dead running around with a golf not. club club and everyone's death? I'm not sure. I didn't ever play number two. And I never beat number one either. I played quite a bit of number one, but I never beat it. Uh, oh, Walking Dead. I thought you said Red Dead. Beg your pardon. That's on me. I read that wrong. Walking Dead. Um, wasn't that... I only watched season one. Uh, but wasn't it that guy Negan? He was in Tekken. He was in Tekken 7, believe it or not. <laughs> he was in Tekken. Yeah, no, it was my fault too, Alan. I misread what you said. For some reason, I read Red Dead Redemption. I don't know why. They're completely different. Uh, Arcade and I, were looking for you. We're gathering the remnants. Been a while, Arcade. So, what's the point of all this? Can't find any younger mercenaries? Uh, your advanced level attack would be useful in settling things between the NCR and the Legion. Uh, there isn't anyone else around with your equipment and expertise. Let's say that one. You can thank the NCR for that one. Wait. This isn't on behalf of the NCR, is it? Uh, no, I was planning on helping... No, not the Legion. I was hoping you'd want to take down the NCR, so that's the plan. Uh, does it matter who we help? Yeah, it does. There's not a chance you'll find me helping the NCR in any way. They've caused me too much grief. Um... Uh, Then you'll be happy to know I'm planning on helping the Legion. I want to help the Legion to... Why? Why have I got two options to say that? One is just, I want to help the Legion. And then the other one is, lie. Then you'll be happy to know I'm planning on helping the Legion. They're the same fucking thing. Why are they not both lies? So you're not coming. Oh, I'll come. But depending on the plan, I might not be staying. Keep that in mind. Arcade might have mentioned there's a passphrase needed to get into the bunker. There we My go. My part is remember. So we've got remember Navarro so far. Uh, what did you... Arcade's been there. Has Arcade been there all along? Has he been to my left all along? What did you do when you were with the Enclave? Heavy weapons trooper. Nothing better than hosing down a target with an excess of bullets and laser fire. By the time I got through with things, not much was left standing. Any morons who didn't run when they saw me coming got what they deserved. Back then, it was war. If we'd been on the winning side, I'd be called a hero. Uh, do you have something against the NCR? Oh, like you wouldn't believe. The NCR makes a habit out of wrecking homes. I came out here to get away from them. Didn't work out so well. Next thing I know, I'm squatting in their land. Never mind that I've already been living here for years. So this guy really hates the NCR, right? What do you do around here? Do? I don't do anything. I'm retired. Uh, 
So what did you do before you were retired? I was a soldier. Why do you even care? <laughs> I came out here to forget about the past, so quit bringing it up. All right, fine. You old git. <laughs> What's up? You not got anything to say about that arcade? I guess not. All right, let's go. Oh! Moreno took the fall of the Enclave hard. He never questioned his orders, never questioned the legitimacy of what the Enclave was doing. To him, it was all one unbroken chain, from Washington to Richardson. When we left Navarro, I remember looking up at Moreno. He said, Kiss America goodbye, boys. When we left the Enclave behind, the love in him burned itself out. Now there's just a bitter old man left. Um, don't be too hard on him, right? He's an old git. I suppose you're right. When you're part of something for that long, maybe it's impossible to let go without losing part of yourself. Moreno may be a stubborn son of a bitch, but at least he's loyal. All right, on to the next one, which shouldn't be too far away, according to the map. We just got to go down by oh, Vault 34. Great. Right. Uh, a lot of these, though, we can fast travel to. Uh, we've got Novak, uh, where we live. And then Jacobstown as well. So let's go to this one, right? Because I don't particularly want to... Uh... Actually, it's quite safe outside of Vault 34, if I'm not mistaken. I might regret this, right? But we got Arcade with us now, and Arcade's a beast. Oh, it's just it's just fire geckos. Or golden geckos, rather. I got my dog, and I've... Look at Arcade with his fucking plasma weaponry. He's a beast. I mean, he, he looks kind of uh, kind of like a beast at the moment, but that's only because we put combat armor on him, right? But when he's in his uh, little followers of the apocalypse coat, he doesn't look like much, but he's got a good gun. He's got a seriously good gun. One of the uh, one of the more powerful uh, companions, Boone as well. Boone is an absolute murder machine, also. Right? I think this get. Th I think this guy is in a cave somewhere. If I'm not mistaken. So I think uh, that little uh, that little uh, triangle marker on our compass. I think that's where he's at. It's a, 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 a location we haven't yet discovered. At least I'm hoping so. Yeah, Cannibal Johnson's cave. Here we go. It is the guy I was thinking of. Let's go in. Uh, traps everywhere, so be careful. I don't have light staff yet, either. Hey, buddy. Oh, someone set off a trap. Well, it's about damn time. What took you? Oh. Oh? I've been in the Reaper's shadow for a long time now. And I thought he finally showed up to collect. I like this He's guy. He's just mocking me now. Uh, Arcade asked me to gather all the remaining members of the Enclave in the Mojave. Thought I recognized the fellow with you. So what's this reunion all about then? Uh, you guys have big guns and are good at fighting. Well, now there's an interesting idea. Do a bit of good before we're all dead and forgotten. You can count me in. Oh, and in case Arcade forgot to mention it, there's a five-word passphrase needed to get into the bunker. My word is fool. So we've got Old Remember and Navarro. What brings you around this time? How much money do you owe this Reaper guy? <laughs> I think I think that's a low intelligence uh, check. Let's say it. What? I was talking about death, kid. Guess that one went right over your head, didn't it? Old Sergeant Dornan would have had a field day with you. <laughs> Who's Sergeant Dornan? He was a drill instructor I knew. He was also the meanest bastard I've ever known. Oh. Once he caught this private out of uniform, and old Dornan went off on the most ear-blistering rant known to man. It was inspiring. I think Sergeant Dornan might be uh, another character from Fallout 2 as well. Uh, you'll have to take... When I'm referring to all these uh, Fallout, previous Fallout uh, references from 1 and 2, you have to take it with a pinch of salt because I've never uh, I've never played uh, 1 and 2. But uh, I, think, I think that's a reference to a, uh, a Fallout 2 character. Uh... <laughs> Sue Allen. Yeah, be in character here, Mecca. Of course, of course, right? Always. We're role-playing. We're role-playing. 
Uh, what did you do when you were with the Enclave? Squad marksman. I'm pretty proud of the fact that I never killed a single soul who wasn't trying to kill me or one of my team first. All right, cool. Uh, you make it sound like avoiding innocent deaths was uncommon in the en Enclave. I'm sorry to say that it was. Civilian casualties was acceptable and sometimes encouraged. My former squad mate Moreno didn't need encouraging. Moreno and I might have killed each other if Captain Krieger hadn't been... So these are the two that are, didn't get along. Uh, tell me about yourself. What do you want to know? So you are a cannibal. Huh. I'm not saying it's part of my mystique after all. Oh, speech check. It sounds like there's an interesting story behind it. The truth of it is that I did cut out a raider's heart, but only took a bite to mess with his buddies. They had me surrounded, and I went with the first thing that came to mind. Some ran, and the rest were startled just long enough. Cool. All right. You live here by yourself? Sure do. Had a wife for a while. Tribal girl. Really pretty eyes. But she's been gone a long time. I don't have any more questions. Let's talk about something else. Well, ain't like I've got places to be. Uh, goodbye. Be seeing you. Maybe. I like Cannibal Johnson. He's cool. If I had to pick anyone who didn't belong in the Enclave, it would definitely be Johnson. He hated what the Enclave was doing. Day to day, week to week, he would question orders, subvert mission objectives, do anything he could to serve without serving. It's amazing he was never court-martialed. He always had good things to say about my father. Said I was like him in a lot of ways. I wish I knew. Uh, worry, why worry about it? You don't have to be your father. I'm sure your father would be proud of you, Arcade. I wonder if he would. It's pointless, I know. But sometimes I wonder what he wanted me to be. Maybe being a doctor in the middle of Nevada wasn't exactly what he had in mind for his little boy. Alright, let's get out of here. Who set off these bear traps? Oh, no. It was probably the dog. Right, okay. Now, the next couple of locations we can just fast travel to. I'm going to go to Jacob's Town. I'm going to go to Jacob's Town now. I was going to say last, but being as the uh, last location is Novak, where we live, we'll go there last, right? Uh, you can probably guess who uh, the uh, remnant is going to be here, right? Because we've already dealt with him quite a bit. Uh, we've already spoken to him. Uh, so he's, uh, he's just in here. It's nice to be back in Jacobstown, right? It's cool. Look at that guy up there. It's not often you come across friendly mutants in Fallout. Oh, Jesus Christ. Doctor! Is there something else I can do for you? Uh, R.K. Gannon has asked me to gather the former members of the Enclave and the Mojave. I'm intrigued. So I'll go to this reunion. I'll be handing things over to Calamity, so talk to her if anything comes up. Oh, you'll need my word from the past phrase to get into the bunker. Friends. So we've got Don't old forget. friends. Remember Navarro. Uh, how goes your research of the Night King cure? No, let's not ask about that. Oh, I can't ask him about the uh, the Enclave in this on this occasion, so let's just go. Doc Henry always was a hard one to figure out. It didn't seem to matter whether he was working with humans or dogs. He had an equal lack Remember, of he fixed both. Rex. A he gave Rex a new brain. I'm not sure what the man was after. Knowledge is power, but to what end for Henry, I have no idea. The problem was what mattered to him, not its practical impact. He simply solved riddles because they existed. Um... <clears throat> His work was what mattered to him. Not everyone dreams of being a revolutionary, I suppose. Maybe we can't all change the world. Maybe it's enough just to do good for the short time that we're here. No one's going to sing Doc Henry's praises when he's gone. But he's probably saved more lives than I ever will. All right, let's go. All right, and then the final one's going to be over in no Novak, apparently. I don't remember who that who that is. Oh, it's not Novak. Do you know what it is? Uh, let's go to Novak anyway, right? <laughs> that was very nice of him. Right, it's over here somewhere. Oh 
Or maybe it is Novak. I know the final one is a lady, right? But I don't remember her living here. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay, we might have to fast travel to get out of here. <laughs> oh my god. Can I... Can, can I... Dang it, alright. Fine. Right, up here. Where's, where's, Ga where's Arcade going? Where are you going, buddy? <laughs> A little confused. Uh, apparently it's up here. I don't remember who this is. I've never seen her before. Ah, you, Daisy Whitman, of course. Fine weather for flying. It's times like She's the Vertibird pilot. Arcade asked me to find you. I'm finding the remnants, and you can fly. Told you everything about us, did he? Well, it's been a while since I've lived here for a while now, and I've never river. come across her. There's a chance I could crash us in the middle of Lake Mead. That place seems to attract aircraft for some reason. But if I get one more chance to fly, count me in. I like Daisy. She's there. cool. My part of the past phrase is dear. So. Old dear friends, remember Navarro. Uh, did you like flying for the Enclave? I was never happier than when I was in the cockpit. I was able to go just about anywhere and everywhere, limited only by the fuel I could carry. There were more than a few missions where I took the scenic route home just so I could stay in the air. Caught hell for it every time, but worth it. Some of the things we did were questionable, I know. That's just how it was back then. Figure I've done enough good to make up for any sins, anyhow. Uh, you were a pilot? <laughs> Vertibird pilot. 71 missions and Classic only Norma. Chopper. Rotor malfunction over Klamath. Hard landing, but I walked away. Uh, what do you do in Novak? I help folks strip down the more complicated bits of salvage they bring in. Engines, mostly. The bits and pieces we take out are usually worth more than the whole thing put together. Don't you dare ask <laughs> better too. No, we've bedded everyone that we can at this point. I think everyone everyone that's possible to sleep with, we slap with in the entire game. I think. Don't quote me on that. Since my mother died, Daisy's been the only woman in my life. She was the only other woman close to my father, too. She flew him out on over a dozen missions. Including his last. I've always been close to Daisy. There have been some good men along the way, but lovers make poor confidants. Daisy never had children of her own, so she was always there to listen. Being in the Enclave didn't mean much to her. She just loved to fly. It broke her heart to be grounded. Uh, it was an important part of her life. Why shouldn't she enjoy it? As screwed up as it sounds, at least she was a part of something. Granted, it was something admittedly pretty bad, but it was something. If you spent the first half of your life flying Enclave troopers in a vertebrate, I suppose picking over pre-war rocket parts doesn't quite compare. Right, okay, so that's every one of the remnants. Uh, now we've got to go... Uh, we should we should have went to uh, Jacobstown last, because it's, right it's right by the bunker. Um, but that's fine, right? We'll go to... We'll go, we'll go and sort ourselves out first. And uh, see if we can uh, see if, if we can deal with any of our, our stats that might be uh, ticking up. Uh, I suspect that our sleep might be. Uh, I don't know what we're going to do about water. We might have to go to Good Spring Source. Because uh, I've got four purified... Yeah, we're going to have to go there, right? Food and sleep we can deal with here, though. Uh, let's... Where have I got that? That's minus two endurance. Hold on. I'm going to put some stuff away as well. Because I got some rubbish in my actual aid tab. Uh, that can go, right? Um, I know I've got Nuka Cola to put away. Ooh. Oh, I may as well eat that. That's just taking up weight. We're full on guns, but I can eat that anyway. Um, Nuka Cola. Put them away. Ah, uh, they're okay. There's no debuff on them. 
Yeah, I've only got four waters. Have I got any stored? I don't think I do. Every time I check. No. Water's been a real issue for us, right? It's been uh, hard to come by. Right, that'll do. Let's eat that magazine, though, before I forget. Because that's two weight. How can a magazine weigh two? Right? Make it make sense. Look at that. Two in weight. Eat that. Uh, eat that as well, because that's food. And we need uh, we need some food. Uh, science. But, uh... Okay. Alright. Job's good in. We'll have, like, say, three hours kip. Alright? Now, I am going to be dehydrated, but that's fine. We're going to go straight over to Good Spring Source to sort that out. I really wish I had more water on me. Uh, where's Good Spring Source? There it is. And then uh, we'll go to Jacobstown, and then we'll head to the bunker from there. Alright, I really need a drink. Help yourself, Arcade. It's good water. Right, that should be good enough. Sleep's good. Food's good. H2O is good. Alright, now off to Jacobstown. And we'll walk to the bunker from there. Alright, sniper out. I can't... Oh, maybe we sh we'll ch We'll check that afterwards. There's not I don't think there's any combat here. If you can avoid it, right? But I can't believe the gun runners didn't have any 308. That's bullshit. I could be sneaking, but all we got to deal with around here is... Actually, I'm going to go over to that gun. Oh, that gun's kind of running low as well. It's fine. <clears throat> it's fine. I think maybe what I'll do between now and next week off stream is just go around and stock up. And uh, actually uh, uh, think about our, our, our final loadout as well. Yeah, we've only got... F right, let's go over to Pew Pew. Pew Pew's got so much ammo. Let's use that, right? That makes more sense. That's a Cazador! A little baby one, though. At first, I just thought it was just like a graphical glitch. A little tiny Cazador. He's dead now, but... The lad's got him. I don't think I even picked up any experience for that. Why was there a Cazador here? It's usually just... Oh, there's trouble over there. Usually just giant mantises and big horners up here. Up this way. And then uh, Night Stalkers when you get closer to Jacobstown. The only problem with Pew Pew is it needs to reload quite often. You get two, two shots and then it needs a reload. Um, we're not in the correct place. Can I jump over here? Oh, there we are. Easy. Yeah, we were around the back of uh, the remnants bunker. Right, let's go. Dear old friends, remember Navarro. Because they all had a piece of the password, right? That's kind of easy to guess, I guess. I don't know. And in we go. This is um, all assets from uh, Fallout 3. If you've played that game, it'll look very familiar to you when you're in uh, the uh, Raven Rock, especially. And in we go. And look at that. Nicely lined up suits of XO1. Beautiful. We've already got power armor training, by the way, but you can get power armor training here if you need it. We've, uh, we're very good friends with the Brotherhood, though, and they've already taught us. And here's the gang. The old Codger gang. 
Alright, who do I need to speak to? I guess the leader, right? My words. Won't be long before the Legion and MCR butt heads over Hoover Dam. Yep. Glad to see you made it here all right. So, who are we going up against? Um How are you going to deploy your squad? Marino, Johnson, Henry, and I will be the boots on the ground. Whitman will stay with the vertebrae. Okay. At this point in time, we're not allied with the NCR, right? But, but we want uh, we want the Legion to lose. So we're going to say the NCR, right? Uh, <laughs> I can't read that. Director Flynn's... Oh, God. Uh, Flying Zentish Betziza. Spitziza. I'm sorry. I butchered that. I know. I know. Uh, I want you to help the NCR hold on to the dam. Then that's the plan. We're going to have a problem with Moreno, though. He won't like that we're helping the NCR. You'll have to talk to him. Um, I'll talk to him, right? You've got only one chance at this. I know Moreno. Once he's made up his mind about something, there's no changing him. Right, so off he goes because he's angry. Now we got to talk our way out of this, right? I didn't come all the way out here just so we could save the fucking NCR. I'm out. Uh, the remnants come in, guns blazing, showing the NCR how it's done. You actually don't want that. I can't believe you've actually talked me into this. You can end up, you can end up, uh, fighting this guy here if you don't have the speech. Thanks for doing this. Getting them all back together again. This approves. I'm sorry. I didn't think we'd all be walking out of there in one piece. I still don't know how this is all going to shake out in the end. But at least the Enclave can atone a bit for all the damage it's done. Uh, you've certainly done your part, Arcade. I've been wondering about Daisy and the others for so long. I still haven't figured out what I should do. I mean, I'm not like them. I was born at Navarro, and my father served with them, but I wasn't really part of the Enclave. It seems presumptuous of me to think I could join the fight, even if this is a cause worth fighting for. Because I know when fighting breaks out of the dam, all hell is going to break loose in Freeside. They're going to need every doctor they can get. Uh, I feel so sure it's going to be a bloodbath. Maybe you should stay in Freeside. What happens in Freeside won't make any difference if the Legion takes the dam. Fight with them. Um, I'm going to tell him to stay in Freeside, right? I'm going to tell him to stay in Freeside. I honestly didn't expect you to say that. When I talked to you about Daisy and the others, you seemed to put a lot of value and loyalty to the past. What's changed since then? You were born at Navarro, but you are your own man. They have their fight and you have yours. True enough, I suppose. Getting them back together must be worth more than me spraying plasma all over the dam. Back to Freeside it is. I need to make a stop before I settle in. I'll be back in a while. Thanks again for your help. It means a lot to me. You've lost Arcade's better healing perk. Oh shit, he's just giving me a bunch of stuff that's going to make me overweight. Oh no. I hear reports of Legion raiding parties all over the place. He's talking to the, he's talking to Rex. Is this is this guy going senile? He just told Rex. <laughs> he just got a, he's going senile this guy. Did you see that? He talked to Rex. That's funny. Right. If I've done everything correctly now, which I hope I have, we should get a present when we leave here, right? We'll bump into arcade and he's going to give us something really really cool, hopefully. Hopefully I've done everything Yes. Like I said, I needed to go do something. This is it. It belonged to my father. I thought I might wear it at Hoover Dam, but after you talked me out of it, I didn't see the point in hanging on to it any longer. I'm here because of you, so I figured you're the one most deserving of it. It should protect you from everything short of a plasma caster. And if you need anything, anything at all, you know where to find me. I'm honored. I'm genuinely honored, Ganon. He's allowing me to wear his father's old exo armor. But that's not all, right? We're going to say we're honored because we are. It's the least I could do. All I ask is that you put it to good use. 
This place has lived in the shadow of Caesar for long enough. I may not be the one to help stop him here, but you are. Portis Fortuna Adiuat. Good luck. And goodbye. Goodbye, Arcade. You were great, right? And even more great. And I'm over encumbered massively. Ganon Family Tesla Armor. We get energy weapons plus 10, rad resistance plus 20. And if we want as well, we can wear the helmet, but I'm going to leave that because um, the first recon beret is really cool. And uh, so is the rebreather, come to think of it. We do lose out on uh, six damage threshold, but the rebreather has already given us uh, three damage resistance, which is different. It's calculated differently. Um, I was hoping that this would give me a bit of a strength boost because we're really overweight at this point. I don't think uh, stakes are going to do it, right? Maybe if I can stack them both. Brahmin steak. We're still over. But if I can stack that with big horner. Oh, I don't have any. Fuck. I don't have any big horner steak? Are you kidding me? Right, Rex. Where is he? Doggo. Right, can you hold on to these combat armors? Oh, we can. Brilliant. All right, fantastic. And now for the grand reveal. Okay, it's a bit of a shame, actually, come to think of it, that our energy... Wa it's, it's, plus, it's 85 at the moment, but 10 of that is coming from the armor, right? Yeah, we get plus 10 from the armor. So we're close to 100. We are close to 100. But the reveal, oh yeah, I told you it was a good reward, right? Look at how badass we are now. Oh, hell yeah. Hell flipping, yeah. This is going to be our new permanent armor as well. So long to our reinforced combat armor. It served us well, right? And uh, so long to Arcade as well. He's off back to Freeside to help any wounded that might uh there might be from uh, the battle that's to come. Uh, we want to go to Novak now. Uh, why can I never find where I want to go? Thanks, Sue Ellen. Thanks for uh, thanks for getting rid of the bot. Uh, now I are uh, easy to see in this traffic. Nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're gonna be hard to miss, right? But uh, it's so cool. Look at that. Look at this Tesla. It's got Tesla coils on it. It's basically, uh, I'm going to show you the helmet as well. It's basically XO. It's uh, Enclave XO armor. But it's, got, it's modified to have all this, uh, these uh, Tesla coils on there. And that's where the plus 10 energy weapons comes from. Look at that. You've got the Enclave symbol right there on the, on the badge as well. Right, I'm going to put my Recon Beret and Rebreather back on, though, because that's much cooler. And it's beneficial to us as well. We get um, 100 Lockpick with this hat and uh, better critical chance. So that's why I'm keeping them on. Uh, right, give me anything that... Oh, hold on. Weapons-wise, I want you to have any uh, Explosive Ordnance, right? Frag mine. That'll do. Now, uh, I only want... Explosives on Doggo. Uh, give me the combat armor back. I'm going to be over encumbered slightly for a second. But we're going to put some stuff away in here. Uh, combat armor. Combat armor reinforced. And the helmet we'll put away as well. Because it's only going to weigh us down otherwise. Um, in How much free carry weight have I got right now? Right. I've got about uh, 21 pounds of carry weight. Being as that we're heading uh, into uh, into energy weapons, let's uh, let's mix up our loadout a bit. Uh, the golf club can go away now. It's served its purpose, right? That gun. Uh, if I can't get if I can't get five five six for that gun, I might put that away as well. Um, let's go with where's the Q forty five mat modulator? Sorry, 35. Beg your pardon. That weighs 7, right? Now, if I put Pew Pew away, and I put away uh, Microfusion cells, because I've got a buttload of them. Not Microfusion, Energy. Beg your pardon. This takes Microfusion. So, get all my Microfusion cells out. I've got a shitload of these. The only thing... Uh, it's going to take a while. 
The only thing that concerns me about the Q35 Mata Modulator is it throws plasma, so it's not the most accurate gun. But I guess we can go over to a handgun or uh, a sniper if we need to be more precise. Uh, I'm going to go aim for like a thousand as well, but that might, that might put me over capacity. This is going to be our heavy hitter, right? It's plasma, so it is going to be uh, a damage dealer. Right, that'll do. Oh, that takes us way over. Right, put away... It's got to be a quicker way of doing this. Oh, there is. Right, put away... Put away another... I don't know, 300, right? Okay. It does like 300 at a time, so... Put them away. I'm still massively... Okay, right, put away 500. It's still massively overweight. I might have to do something to boost my strength permanently. Whether I take intense training or something on my next... Uh, I'm still overweight. Um, Alright, I tell you what, right? Put away... Put away another hundred. Huh? What just happened? I'm taking them out! Oh my god, I'm such a dummy. Yeah, I'm taking them out. No wonder my weight's going up. Right, put away... That many. Oh, that's much better, right? We'll take uh, roughly 500. Um, I can put the 357s away. For now. Uh, we just need to pick up more 308 and 557. If, uh, if the gun runners have got them to sell. Uh, so let's fast travel over to the gun runners real quick. Uh, I can, can never find where I want to go. Right. Gun runners. Here we are. It has ventilation. It do. It be do. Welcome, sir or madam. Right. You better have good ammo, buddy. 308s. Give me all of those. Uh, I'll take the armor piercing and the hollow point as well. What else did we need? 556. Five, uh, it looks like he's restocked, which is good. Right, 5.56. Five, Give me all of that. Armor piercing, yes. Ho hollow point, yes. Uh, let's go. Right, am I over capacity now? I am not, okay. Uh, one last check. Right, how good has he been? He's not been keeping his uh, family armor in good condition. So, one last trip, okay, is going to be to the Mojave Outpost. To see Major Knight and get this armor repaired. Shame on Ganon for not looking after his dad's armor. It's like nearly half condition. This is going to cost a fortune as well. It's going to cost an absolute fortune. How is my Q5 mo mo matter modulator? That might need some repairs as well. I need to favorite that. We'll put that there. Hold on, let me just put that on and... Oh, now that just... That just tops it all off, doesn't it? This Q35 Matter Modulator just makes it that much better. Now we look badass. Am I right? Let's go. Alright, Major Knight. Been doing a lot of good work out there. I know. An example for the others. Uh, I need repairs. Alright. Right, we need to repair... The Tesla armor. And we will... We'll repair this as well. Right? Because that gives it a little bit more uh, attack power. Uh, everything else is fine. Okie dokie. That cost me an absolute fortune. I wasn't actually paying attention to how much. How are my caps looking? Oh, we still got 25 grand. That's fine. Okay. Right. Let's go back to... How is my stats looking? Uh, H2O. Okay, if that's the case, right, we'll go back to, uh, uh <laughs> sorry, pardon me. Why do we need, why is our quest on the, oh, tell, okay, right, we left uh, the bunker before we were done. So let's go there, and then uh, we'll wrap up today by going back to Good Spring Source and uh, getting some hydration. Because uh, now I'm dehydrated, but that's fine. We'll sort that out shortly.
I actually forgot to complete the quest while I was here, so that's on me. I got so excited by my new shiny armor. It is great, though. I mean, come on. Look how fucking cool we look. Sorry, but we do. I'm sorry. Right? Come on. Moreno's a stubborn son of a bitch, but he's also tougher than any of us. I'm glad you were able to talk him into staying. No problem. Since Whitman will be staying with the vertebrate, she's offered to give her old suit of power armor to you. You'll need um, special training to use it properly. So talk to uh, her as soon as you get the I'm, chance. I'm wearing... I'm wearing... I'm wearing shiny power armor. Can he not tell? The training might take several hours. I'm already get trained. <laughs> I'm already trained. <laughs> Daisy. I appreciate you keeping Orion in the group. And since I won't be needing... Yeah, the it's fab. Makes the cockpit a bit cramped. You should take it. It'll take a few hours to show you how to use it properly, so let's get. I'm already started. trained. I'd love to see the look on the NCR's face when I swoop. Oh, now I've got to. I could have saved money by smashing these two together. She just gave me her. Right, what's plus one gonna give me carry weight wise? I'm gonna put this on temporarily, right? And then with uh, with a stake, can we get out of here? We can manage it. All right. I'm going to go. No, oh, flipping heck. All right. Be cool. <laughs> Colleen, what's up? How are we doing? Uh, let me drop a pause real quick. Happy Big Friday, Colleen. How are you? But does he have pe <laughs> Pepe ventilation? Uh, misclicked. Oh, on the... Uh, on the old alerts. Ah, never mind. Never mind. Okay, let me get you a shout out though. Make sure I don't misclick, right? How you doing? How's your week been? Hopefully, hopefully a good one, right? What did my fully erect alert? Never mind. Never mind. There's always next time. Yo, Colleen, isn't there another one of these games coming out soon? Like, wrong way. A space one? Isn't there a space one coming out? Didn't it just get announced or something? What are they called? Marquee or Supermassive? Something like that. But yeah, there's another one of these these games coming out. I know you like them. So I wondered if you uh, if you knew. And if you were excited. Right, let's get back to... Right, we'll go... Good Spring Source. Get rehydrated, right? And then we got to dump all this uh, power armor that we just got given. Uh, back in Novak. Uh, so, good spring source. Uh, my stake is gonna. Enemies are nearby. What do you mean enemies are nearby? Oh, over there. F flip sake. I can't fast travel because there's a flipping enemy over here. Stopping me for some reason. What enemy is over here? Who dares? Who dares? Oh, I'm not. I'm, I'm not. <laughs> there we go. Was that really delayed? Did it take a while? Uh, <clears throat> I'm alright, thanks. Just had Chinese. I'm jelly. I'm gonna have some chicken and rice after stream. That's as good as it gets for me. Uh, the casting of Frank Stone is coming out soon, which is set in the... T oh, yeah, there's that as well, right? I heard about that one, too. It's those guys making a, a, a Dead by Daylight game. I remember that now. Uh, good spring sauce. Let's go. My steak's gonna run out when we get here, but that's fine. I got loads of steak. Uh, ugh, thirsty. Give me water. Right. Be cool. I didn't reload either after sh killing that mantis. Right, that should be enough. Uh, let me just double check. Yeah, H2O's on one. Eat another Brahmin steak, and then we're gonna go to Nova. Oh. Who said that? <laughs> uh, <laughs> how am I? I'm very well. Thanks for asking. It's Big Friday. We're playing some Fallout. I'm hanging out with you guys in the chat who are all great. And uh, I couldn't be better, really. Could not be better. Um, I want some food now, now that you bring up Chinese. But other than that... Oh, bloody hell. Over-encumbered. Right, I'm... Going ham on this stake just to move around the uh, map now. It's a bit of a waste. Bit of a waste. Right. Uh, let's pop. 
Let's pop our other armor on. Right, our, our good armor. So, Ganon family armor. And we'll put the other power armor away. And job is a good one. Let's put the Q35 matter modulator on because it looks flipping cool with my armor. Uh, all we need to do now, we need to get energy weapons up by 15. Because uh, then we'll be at 100. As long as we're wearing this armor. And uh, jobs are good and right? But uh, I think that's a good place to leave it for this week. Uh, now that we've picked up our sexy new uh, Exo Tesla power armor. And uh, helped out Ganon uh, with, uh, with his uh, old-timey chums. And also thrown our lot in with uh, Yes Man and committed to a side. Oh, and we helped the uh, Great Khans avoid uh, slavery as well. So that was nice. That was nice. Do you look like a retired Ghostbuster and his dog? <laughs> I look cool, okay? The Exo Enclave Tesla power armor is fucking cool. It's cool. It's cool power armor. It's cool power armor. I'm quite fond of uh, the Hellfire armor as well, but I don't even know if that's in this game. I think that's uh, Fallout 3... And uh, as a little bit of a bonus extra with the update that they uh, added to Fallout 4 recently. Uh, but I'd rather the game worked properly than get Hellfire armor in Fallout 4. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Uh, Okie dokie. Right, I can close the uh, poll now. Um, are we still live? We're still live. I've got an error. I've got an error on my uh, my own page. Ah, right, okay. I think we know where we'll be raiding next, right? Because uh, it's kind of tradition on a Friday. It's kind of tradition. I've got a couple of things to say, though, uh, before uh, we uh, we wrap up and say our good nights. Uh, thanks to Big Beans for the raid earlier. Uh, the Lost Keeper, thank you very much for the follow as well. And the True Mantis, thank you very much for following as well. Although, um, you might retract that after my uh, uh, comments about Tobey Maguire. Uh, hopefully not, though. Hopefully not, right? Hopefully not. Hopefully you're still uh, amongst us. Uh, but uh, thanks to all of you guys as well for hanging out today. Thanks for uh, taking part in my polls. Uh, all of them. The one in the chat earlier and the two that I put up on my socials, on my uh, Twitter and my YouTube. <coughs> Speaking of which, uh, shameless plug. But uh, follow me on my socials if you want to keep up to date. I'm not only on Twitter, if that's not your jam. I'm also on Instagram, if you prefer that platform. And uh, go sub to my YouTube as well. Because all of my back catalogue of streams and series in the past are all up there. Uh, for you to enjoy at your leisure. If you wish. If you wish. Thanks for hanging out with me. Thanks for spending your big Friday here with me uh, in the Mojave. Uh, I really appreciate your time. More than anything, really. Uh, more than anything else. Uh, I appreciate that you spend a bit of your time here with me. Uh, watching me play video games. So thank you very much for that. From the bottom of my heart. I don't do this enough either. But thank you to the Mecha Mods. Uh, this wouldn't run smoothly without you. This whole operation is held together with spit and string. So thanks to the Mecha Mods as well. And uh, if I'm leaving anyone out... I sincerely apologize. I really appreciate you all, though. Uh, thank you so much. Next week, uh, we'll be jumping back into the Mojave uh, and uh, getting on with things. We're getting really, really close to uh, the Battle of Hoover Dam, which is exciting. Exciting stuff. Exciting stuff. I think we'll be going to Hoover Dam next week anyway to try and save uh, the NCR president, President Kimball. So uh, that'll be exciting stuff, too. Um, I will be back tomorrow... As always, we'll be back in uh, Super Mario Sunshine tomorrow. Uh, I'll be going live at, or aiming for, uh, 2 p.m. UK time. A little bit earlier tomorrow. Uh, if it's helpful to anyone, 2 p.m. UK time is five hours ahead of Eastern, if that's helpful to anyone. It's also an hour behind Germany, if that's helpful to anyone as well. Uh, every other time zone in the world, though, I don't know. You'll have to Google it, right? Google what 2 p.m. UK time is, and it'll tell you. It'll tell you in your time zone what uh, what that is. What that is. Uh, Sue Ellen, no prob. I get to bully random people. <laughs> no, it doesn't help. <laughs> okay. 
All right. But uh, thank you once again, okay? And uh, however long is left of your big Friday. Oh, I haven't done the shout out or the raid. I, uh, pff, shambles. Shambles. Well, you know where we're going anyways, right? It's a bit of a tradition on a Friday night. So, uh, let me give him a shout out anyway. This is my homie, right? Re really good guy. Good friend of mine. A good friend of the channel as well. So, uh, when we get over there, um, consider showing him some support. And you'll be doing me a solid at the same time as well. This is my homie Christian. Okay, while that, that clip is playing, I'll set up the raid. And then uh, then I'll, I'll do my uh, good nights uh, and everything as well. Uh, there we go. That's locked and loaded. I'm ready to go. <laughs> <laughs> I, can, I can only imagine that. <laughs> yeah, Let's go. Stupid, like, you mean it. Yeah, I gotta do it like, like this. With the, with the, the pinky in the air. <laughs> mm. Mm. Gotta Let's go. The, the taste. Let's go. Right, I'm gonna pull the trigger on this ready raid. However long is left of your big Friday, enjoy yourselves, okay? Pie hard, by all means, be merry, but don't be daft with it, okay? Take care of yourselves and take care of each other as well because that's really flipping important too. We've got to have each other's backs and stick together, uh, especially these days, right? Especially these days. Hopefully, I'll see you tomorrow in the next one for Super Mario Sunshine. But until then, take care and good night. Bye-bye. Nosta.